Uncle's Games. Hey guys, today we're making some Sweet Teach Pops. And so, this is new. My mom found this inside the store, the 99. But I'm going to open this up. And it comes with directions, bags. I don't know how many bags. But, but these bags have lots of stuff inside them. This one's a little bit squishy. That's going to be interesting. Take out this box of cardboard. Not going to that. We have these. And a gummy tray. I don't even know what this is. And now we have the tray where we put all of our popsicles. And then our gummies at the bottom. So there are lots of ways you could do this. You could just have popsicles, then put all the gummies at the bottom, just eat popsicles and gummies. Or put gummies inside the popsicles and put gummies on the bottom and just have that. Or just, well, pop, plain old popsicles and nothing at the bottom. There's lots of ways, but first, we're going to have to read these directions. I like my mom reading my directions because I'm terrible at reading, but, oh, easy. Okay, so we got our hot water, two of the same types of teaspoons, one, one teaspoon, some sharp scissors. Now, this is going to be dangerous because we're going to have to cut these types of bags with lots of powder inside it with very hot water, which is actually very hot. It would burn your fingers. And we're going to have to pour it carefully into these little tiny gummy trays. So, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to open up this bag. I think this is the cherry one. I know this is. It smells like cherries. And it's the cherry. So we're going to push that cherry thing out. And if you can see right there, there's like some cherries in it. Boom. Oh, we're gonna just pour this. Pour it all in. Just gonna pour this all in. So just one bowl. We're gonna have to make sure this is perfect. Uh, great. So just flatten that down. Just one bowl. You can use your fingers if you want. Just. So this one's probably the blue raspberry. Raspberries. Oh yeah, and also kids, raspberries are not blue. Smells like sour patch kids. Smell it. Sniff it. Sniff it. Sniff it. Okay, well, we're gonna have to put like 1600 pounds of this stuff in. I'm gonna probably just eat the blues. No blue left. And now we're supposed to put it inside this hot water. So slowly and carefully take this off, and we're gonna have to use one measuring spoon. Okay, so guys, we have our teaspoon, and make sure those two teaspoons, one wet one and one dry one, I'm going to pour the wet teaspoon right in here. Play-Doh. Ready. Okay, so I'm just going to pour. Oops. <laughs> oh yeah, if 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 you want to see me and Nathan do a video together. Leave a leave a like. This is my puzzle. So we filled all of our molds, and now we have to put them inside the refrigerator for thirty seconds. And while we're doing that, we're gonna be making these. I'll be back in thirty minutes. Okay, so 
we have our gummy mix inside the bags while the gummies are freezing up. And all the popsicle molds are getting ready, but we first have to weigh how much popsicle molds, how much popsicles do we need. So we have fruit punch pop mix, frozen pop mix, and the fruit punch one is very sticky, so we're going to pour through this one because it's very sticky. Open up my favorite one because I love fruit punch and oranges and lemons. The fruit punch one is 20 gigi chunks. We pour this all in. For one cup of water. Okay, so one teaspoon. So two of those scoops. One, two. Daddy, we are. So now I'm just going to open up the orange. I can't wait to see what this one smells like. Now we're gonna do lemon! I love lemons. They taste good on your fruit. Oh, this does not smell good. It smells so sour. Just me. But the lemon one's the only one who's not chunked up. Not. He says no. Okay, so we have our gummies out. It's been 30 minutes, pretty long time. Well, you guys did not see it, but I was waiting and waiting. And, my dad and these are very cold, and they smell delicious. Like they actually smell like play though. <laughs> this is how you make homemade gummies. Not really that gummy-ish. You can just flatten them out and they will not pop back up. <gasps> Blue raspberry and cherry. Okay, we're mix, mix it up till it's all dissolved. Turns it into lemonade. This is not how you make lemonade. You want me to pour the other ones in for me? Yeah, pour them in the So we have orange juice, fruit punch. Mm, I want to just take a little tiny sip. Let me just take a sip. Make sure to constantly mix these. Mostly you should just do one of these at a time, but I have to do lots. So, first we have to cut it. Okay, so I just pried out one of these little guys and we're going to scooch him in there. It's a cute little crescent, like a moon. And we're gonna put another crescent inside the other one. Ah! We'll put split. So we're gonna put two crescents to make just one. And though, so I was just thinking of just putting one gummy in each one. So we're gonna just do that. Oh. I'm trying to be gentle. Okay, so I did put it inside the lightning bolt. We're just going to scooch out everything from the lightning bolt and just apply it in. So I took out every single one I wanted. Put the gummies out here. Okay. And then we're going to just fill these all up. Slow and steady makes perfect. And now just put it inside yours. Make sure you do not fill it up to the top because once you put something inside it. And so this one's blue. There's blue in this one because that's red and that's going to be what's going in here. 
I kind of made some mistakes, but mistakes happen. Nothing going to be bad. And the last one is going to be, oh, my favorite one. I hope I did not spill this one because I do not want to get anything else wet. These gummies are so good. So, Courtney, when you pour it, you want to make sure you pour it right over this part right here. Okay. Okay. Not go slow. Good job. I go quick. And you have all of these. And now, all we're of... ready to freeze them. No, we're not. We have to skip them. This is this. Now they have to go to the freezer until they're totally dead. So here is like the picture of how it looks. It's supposed to look off like that. I don't know if the gummies will fail, but we did not have enough time to fill off these gummies. But I'm going to pound up. But I'm going to eat this hot one and see how they taste. You see, I kind of put two inside. They taste delicious. Okay, but I'm going to take the final reveal of our, of this popsicle. I open. So I just opened it up, and you can barely see the gummies. Barely. So we're just gonna. So I'm just gonna eat it and see how it tastes. It tastes like fruit punchy and stuff. Put orange one. And yeah, might taste good. This orange one might taste better. I choose fruit punch. We should never. It's watery. Very watery. Mm. What do you think would make the fruit punch flavor better? Hmm. Does it need a stronger flavor or a less strong flavor? It needed more sugar. And we have many more, and we have plenty more of these, so I could eat all of these ones, and then everybody else gets us. Good. We're gonna try the orange one now. I hope this one tastes better. Oh, that's tart. Very sweet. I'm just gonna sip that back in there. And the last one's the lemon. It tastes like lemonade. Have you come across the gummies? What do the gummies feel like in the popsicle? Um, I don't really know. I do not really taste them. But I'm going to have to feel good. Okay, I'm going to just pound on all of these gummies. <laughs> Goodbye. Please like and subscribe.